So, band lab. Band lab. Okay. So you click on band lab, you come to your home page right here. Okay, this is where you can find your messages, people's tracks they've posted recently. La da 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 da. Uh, so if you want to it's kind of hard to find beats on here that most people like actually let you use so I usually just upload new beats all the time so in order to get into the mix studio okay see this plus at the bottom the red circle okay you're gonna hit that button I'll bring you here this is where you, before you go into the studio basically you got you can do samples you can make beats you know there's different things we'll go into that later um, for if you want to add a beat we go all the way to the left here to import track okay you hit that then you pick a beat out of your phone memory your whatever say these are all my beats I already have those all on there but let's just pick say that one okay you got a beat now there's a beat stupid beat okay now if you just hit record this is what you're gonna get when you play back no sound look at it, you're recording over the beat right now and that's not gonna work you stop and play back see so we're gonna undo that down here bottom left okay now what you gotta do close this little guy think of them as channel lines okay that's channel one see this plus on the left you hit that and you have to add a voice slash mic channel for every one you want to do so I'm gonna add that one see now you're on a new channel line and if you click on this one above it right here call import track see how you're back on that blue it changed blue down here it turns green okay you've got to make sure you're on the right track to record so now from here you could hit record and it's gonna record your vocals with the beat on golden yeah okay boom X okay now you got a recording under it you can if you take this click on it you can hold down on it and move your vocals wherever you want Ooh, tricky huh okay so say that's your verse that you recorded and you uh, need to do layers you just same thing plus add another layer and then booyah we can record over our recording Nothing. that's just loud and annoying that's an old beat <laughs> so now you got something crazy like that oh that sounds terrible anyway <laughs> that was bad examples as far as that goes but that's how you you can do as many of those as you want you can boom you can do you can rename them you do layer after layer after layer if you want right so basically that's how you would upload a beat to start recording on BandLab to save it up in the upper right we'll go into effects on a different video but in the upper right here you got this little arrow cloud you hit that you can either save it private or publish it to be for everyone to whatever see so say you hit save you pick the picture name description genre if you go down to this additional settings you can master your track you can select a band to put it in now allowing forks is that's how other people can get on your track so if you wanted people to be able to get onto it you have to have that on or else nobody can get on it and it's just they're fucked I mean I didn't say fucked <laughs> but yeah anyway um, you can check that if you want once you select a band though you can't switch it like it's done on that band so you can't move it from there um, so just you know make sure you really want it in the band um, picture whatever and then you just hit save It'll save. You can hit view down here and it'll pop up. Look at that. It's processing. Okay.